they cramp our lives, you know, the worries of the days, the things, how we go pay bills, how we go stand, how we go pay bills, how we go take survive the day. So many things don't cramp our life. It don't make so many of us. We, yes, we sit down, Some even some of us, we sit down sometimes, and when they, even the man or the woman of God, they preach the word, he go, he go dead there. After three minutes or five minutes, we not even they hear the word again. We know the year I mean, we just did the answer register. Say we come, we sit down for church, or we therefore we are the word that they preach. But what I want to say so, as a, an individual, you know, every one of us will give account of our own self. You will give account for your own self. So thank God that the Holy Spirit did there for as a helper. And thank God, I thank God because every day by day, when you seek and seek and ask and seek to know more about God through his word. Trust me, he will reveal you, he will empower you, he will equip you with so much. And when you don't read the word, you don't take it, it make you meditate, stay cool. Listen to the message, you don't hear it, you don't take consumer. Listen to it, make you digest and listen to the word, the Holy Spirit waiting will minister to you through that word. So my people, I just want to say that here we go end our talk talk today. We know we'll go past this. But please leave us a comment on the comment box. And leave us a comment. We would like to hear from you. Thank you so much. This month, don't be month, maybe say we talk about faith. And this month was so interesting for me. And it was so powerful for me. I discovered new things about myself, about my faith in this month. And I thank God for giving us, granting us the opportunity to know more about him, to know more about his word. I know that most of us read the word, but you go pray and ask God that as you read the word, make you be the doer of the word and make you be able to know him more and discover him more, work with the Holy Spirit more, closer to him more. You know, this period, I will just leave us a little bit of, uh, I don't know what call advice, but I don't know what I'll call them advice or tips, but anyhow, take one out of the two. Stay close, stay connected to your fellow Christians. Stay connected to your, to your brethren, to the, to the household of faith. In, especially this period, we need each other. We need each other. Pray with people. Pray. Wake up every day. Pray. Study the word. Meditate on the word of God daily. As I said, in, when are they talk, they come. Say, this season, this period, yes, it's not easy. But now those when it refuse to take her easy, now go stand strong. So that when you know the word and you bank enough of those words inside the, your faith bank, when Satan come with temptation, you go fit overcome her. Just like the way Jesus Christ overcome Satan when devil himself, if devil himself could tempt the most the, the God, the devil himself could tempt God, the higher authority that he, he could tempt her. So who be you? Who be me when not go fit tent? So the more we know, and ask Jesus Christ to overcome devil, to overcome Satan. Now the word, he spoke the word because he know the word, because he is the word. Thank you so much. I almost want to say praise the Lord, but I just remember saying that now I go talk with TV, now they not be church. So my people, may the Lord continue to bless you. May the Lord continue to pour his oil upon every one of us. May his light continue to shine upon us all in the name of Jesus. May this season that the Satan has opened different doors to attack us believers, to attack the Christian, or to attack the house of faith, may he fall and may the house of God, may the church of God continue to progress. As we go even online and as we meet in building, in the name of Jesus. May his power continue to expose all his secrets to us in Jesus' name. May him continue to shine his light upon our path. May he continue to answer us. May he give us the heart to discover him more. May the Holy Spirit becomes our friend, becomes our keeper, becomes our helper, becomes our protector, becomes our guide 
in every way in Jesus' name. I pray for us today because I know that this, this season, this period is a challenging period for all of us. But I know that we serve a God that do everything, that is more powerful, all powerful, all powerful, all powerful. Just remember to hold your sword, the word, hold your sword. Put on your shield, on your faith, wear your garment, get up where where by studying the word. Don't just be the one where they, they hear the word, but don't do it. Do be a doer of the word, but just don't be a hearer alone. May God bless us all in Jesus' name.